So here's a little bit overview on the custom made dox trailer because there was kind of kind of big interest uh, during travel from many people around who are stopping us and asking where did we buy this trailer uh, so let's say that we decide to make a little review of this uh, which is basically a travel kitchen as well. It's not just the, the uh, dog trailer. So in here, as you can see, we have uh, mesh, uh, plastic mesh or net, uh, which allow the dog to jump in or jump out very easily. Inside in here, uh, under this, we have uh, around four or five centimeters of uh, memory foam that absorbs a lot of uh, vibrations when the dog this is the attachment for the dog that he can be safely uh, inside the box of course he will not jump out anyway uh, he always put his legs in here or head uh, and observing around this is just the protection foam in here we have a special pocket where we have a uh, dog's uh, water uh, plastic uh, dish then we have uh, some liquid for washing dishes and spare tubes and glue and patches for the and some spare water for the dog and in here uh, these rods are very light aluminum alloy uh, rods which uh, are in here positioned uh, for later on use when we cook and when we eat because this is uh, important for uh, support the table which is attached uh, on the trailer uh, we'll take this out and in here we have as well we have some some stripe just to safely guard this if you have a lot of uh, frontal wind that it doesn't open this uh, door so fast. Uh, in here we have tail light and then we have another lights in here. These chocks are for and these uh, two reflectors are just used for support. So when we when we park in camp for instance we just turn around these lights just like that that we don't uh, kind of damage them. And then of course what we do we reattach the trailer from the uh, bike and then we simply bend it over like this and then you have all of a sudden you have a cooking table so this is the right height you put the cooker in here then you have dishes water and this then use, is used like a storage you put in here in vertical position like this let's say six or seven bottles of fresh water then we have a cooker on the top on that and we just safely close it when we're not using it in here we have a hanger basically for the different type of bags maybe for trash maybe for food and then we have uh, the table which is hidden underneath so what we do we just uh, remove these two spiders we have a magnet attached as well but for dumping damping uh, vibrations we remove it as well so then we just unbend this table like this in here we have some attachment points as you can see in here we just do like this one and two like this and we have full uh, custom table where we can eat this table uh, basically it holds around 12 kilograms of load so if you have a chair or maybe you have a wood uh, to sit around and it's very stable this will not turn it over uh, it doesn't bother when you sit uh, when you eat if you sp uh, spill some water there is a special groove in here which will uh, literally collect all the water and it will leak down there uh, so yeah 
uh, when we when we were uh, in the camp and if we need the trailer to transport the dock uh, you need just simply one minute to reattach uh, all the the stuff simple like that the table is bent over you use these spiders this is the first one and this is the second one no, maybe it's too tight because the temperature like this and you just simply put the cooker the dishes in the tent or near the tent and you bend it over and just reattach to the bike again so the dock uh, is ready again uh, to jump in and we continue the uh, the trip so um, let's say this 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 basket or this box is made from wood it is uh, made from wood on purpose it's a little bit heavier on heavier side but uh, I can tell you that this trailer even though it has 25 kilometers an hour speed limit it was tested on descent even until 75 kilometers an hour it doesn't vibrate it doesn't uh, put any uh, side forces on the bike because as you can see in here this is a special hook which is attached to the center of this uh, of this tube and as well you have some additional reinforcement plate uh, for stabilize all the vibrations so it works like a shock absorber when you're braking it just allows you a little bit of uh, play in here in this direction so we don't feel immediate force but it's very stiff in the in the opposite direction in this lateral direction uh, some trailers on the market they have attachment on the axle that's very dangerous if you would go 70 kilometers an hour or on the corners you would feel like something is trying to pull over the road your rear uh, uh, side of the bike in this case when we have attachment in here uh, it is very stable for fast speeds uh, and so far this trailer has around 1000 kilometers or more and there was no any kind of trouble with that you can push this this entire the bike the equipment maybe was 65 kilograms with the dock together and it can go with these gears up to 10 percent very very normally but after 10 percent then you will have to use the small sprocket the, the smaller gear uh, on the chain ring uh, to reduce uh, the speed and increase the rpm but in general uh, yeah this is what this was designed for it's basically a travel kitchen and travel house for the dog and the dog enjoys his life uh, fully he is so crazy that he jumped inside even if we're just resting he just wished to go on to go on to go on so hope you like it and see you around soon bye